100 Who's news? They like catchy. Why no cops are catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they're not as safe. They base it. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Q, Bruce, Cruz, two screws lose. They like Cratchy, why no cops are catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo, goo, dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo, boo, too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know this station. They base it. Yeah. Hello, welcome to another day here in the eFootball community of Ghana. The FIFA community today, there is an opportunity for Ghana to represent itself on that grand stage in Abidjan for the Orange Esports Experience. And usually, there's a player, one player that is selected to represent the nation. But then, in this case, we have two of the top players who, in recent times, won you know some of the very exciting tournaments. But then, both of them aren't allowing each other the opportunity to go right so there's a decider match being played here today it's a best of five series between them to separate them to get a winner who present ghana and of course probably the other would have to stay and support and so these two players come in the persons of la Bista and of course magic man all from the Geo legends team and so they are coming up against each other in a best of five series so without wasting much time uh this is brought to you by the ghana esports federation of course in collaboration with arena 233 where we are coming live from my name is vespa kufisapon i'll be your host and Shoutcast for this match. So let's get straight into the match without wasting any more time. It is the five, I mean, the best of five series decider for the Orange Esports experience. Let's get into it. All right, so on your screens, you can see Paris Saint Germain playing with the French, the French national team. Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like Cratchy, why no Cratchy Cratchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo Goo Dude, me at your ex and your Goo Goo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Screws, two screws lose. They like Cratchy. Why no Cratchy Cratchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know this station. They base it. All right, so we're getting into that match now. It is that best of five series decider between Magic Man and La Bista. And this is the match that is separating these two gentlemen for which we will be getting a winner representing Ghana on that grand stage in Abidjan come the 28th and 29th of January this year, particularly this weekend actually. So here we go, the kickoff is on. It is La Bista, as I've announced, playing with that Paris Saint-Germain team. They are in that blue-black home strip. And of course, the French national team, they are in that white strip with the blue pants too much. And here's La Bista controlling affairs very early on. It's Renato Sanchez, the ball roll, trying to find Hakimi, who's an attacking position here. But then, of course, Magic Man doing his defensive duties there, getting that ball away into some safe space. It is a corner kick, Lionel Andres Messi, the World Cup winner, asking his boys to cool down. He's behind that ball right here. Mind you, it's five minutes a half for each of these games. We'll be witnessing corner kick floated in there. It's Kimpembe, Presnel Kimpembe, it's still a good attack here for Paris Saint-Germain, but then beautiful dispossession there from Magic Man who looks to carry away the ball. It's Osman Dembele searching through pass there. Can Mbappe get to it? But then, of course, goalkeeper Gianluigi de Roma was there first to get the ball away into safe space. Early days yet, but then there's a strong intent of attack from both sides here. La Bista versus Magic Man in here. It's Magic Man trying to get those stepovers, but then couldn't do it in time and so La Bista clears off his line. It is Mendes gets the ball to his captain. Marquinhos right here. La Bista taking his time, trying to control affairs at his own pace. Ball in defense right here. Hakimi looking to start an attack here. Finds Renato Sanchez, who is surprisingly playing on that right wing of attack for Paris Saint-Germain. I wonder why. La Bista is particularly going with this tactics, but then 
he knows definitely best. Renato Sanchez on that right flank lost the ball in there. A moment of confusion, but then, of course, Mike Nan, the goalkeeper for Magic Man, getting that ball. 40 minutes of action in the first half of the first game right here. Mind you, it's a best of five series, so whoever comes stop is definitely getting that ticket to represent Ghana on that international stage. It is the Orange eSports experience, which will be featuring more than about 16 countries all from Africa. The best coming up against each other here. Magic Man with that French national team in possession here. It is Chouameni finds Hernandez. Ball gets to Rabiot in the middle. Andre Rabiot twisting and turning back to Chouameni. But then a faulty pass there gets the ball straight away to La Pista, who would be wanting to build a fast attack right here. But then Neymar Jr. couldn't get to it. And Magic Man definitely gets that ball again. 22 minutes played in the first half here. No goal yet between two sides. Both players are actually playing a cautious game right here. No one is really committing. No one is making those dangerous attacks right here. They are all playing a steady game right here, trying to probably steady each other. But mind you, both players are same team members from the Junior Legends team. So they definitely know each other's gameplay so, so well. So it will be taking you know, some fine line to actually divide them right here. And so I'm wondering who is going to win this particular one. If you're joining us on the stream, let us know your comments right here. It is that deciding game between Magic Man and La Bista. Magic Man in some dangerous attacking moments right here. But then, of course, Sergio Ramos doing that defensive duties right there. Renato Sanchez now finds Ramos, who is playing as a defensive midfielder in this particular case. Renato Sanchez couldn't go beyond Jules Kunde. But then there's a throw in quickly affected by La Bista. And these two players were the ones who actually won that recent JGC Rapper Country tournament right there. And so they have earned the rights to come up against each other in this particular face-off right here as we are looking for just one contender to represent Ghana out there. It is Magic Man now who isn't really getting his passes to the targets. But then here comes Mbappe trying to pull a quick one right there on Marquinhos, but then Sergio Ramos coming to save La Bista in that moment. It's Verratti, the Italian international, finds Hakimi, who puts the ball down for his captain, Marquinhos. Cautious gameplay, like I've said, is what we are witnessing right here. Neymar Jr., the Santos, the Brazilian, finds Mbappe. Kylian Lutin Mbappe finds Verratti. Marco Verratti couldn't get any meaningful pass right there. I'm wondering why these players, it looks like it is a very big stage for them, so they are very nervous at this moment. Faulty passes here and there, not really meaning to attack as they would have if they were playing a 2v2 game against some other opponent. But then here comes Hakimi on the right flank. Lofted pass there, lofted cross. Couldn't find a target, but then here comes Renato Sanchez, finds Messi, but why would Messi cut back? That was an opportunity for La Pista to probably get a first goal right here, but then that wayward pass there from Lionel Messi to no one in particular. And here comes Sergio Ramos, who is advancing from defensive midfield role into attacking, but then that brings us to the end of the very first half right here of the first game between La Pista and of course Magic Man but then we aren't wasting any much time so definitely straightly we are going into that second half of the game the remaining 45 minutes is going to determine if we are going to be getting some goals or we are definitely going to get into the next game mind you it's a best of five series so right after a game we're going straight away into the next game no time to waste no quarter fine no I mean no extra time no penalties we go straight away until the very last game. Abomecano, who is playing on that right back role for Magic Man, finds Thiago Mendes. Mendes back to Abomecano. Mecano finds Mbappe, but Mbappe couldn't get to it. That is now La Bista with his Paris Saint Germain team trying to build an attack right here. 52 minutes of action and no goal yet. Nothing to separate both sides. Neymar Junior de Santos twisting and turning that Brazilian 
who really was heartbroken when the Brazilians had to bow out against the Koreans. Wow, look at that. Labista trying to pull a quick one on Magic Man, but then, of course, excellent goalkeeping from Magnan, preventing that goal from coming through for Labista. It is Magic Man now. Aurelien Chomeni finds up Mekano. Mekano, who is striding right there on the right wing, finds Dembele, who has slowed down the pace of the game now. It's Dembele wondering who to pass to. He finds up Mekano, but then, well, what is happening? Magic Man seems to have lost his magic touch. And Labista isn't Labistin too. What is happening between these two players? I'm looking for goals right here. And they are just prodding the ball around with no particular aim. It's Dembele here for the French national team. Magic Man trying to create some spaces in there. It is Stromeni finds Mbappe. Quick one to Griezmann. Griezmann finds Mbappe again. It is now Dembele finds Mbappe. Griezmann gets it to Rabio. Rabio looking for a target for a pass right here. Finds Jermaine in midfield. A quick one right here. Mbappe! Excellent strike, but then rather an excellent goalkeeping there from Gianluigi Donnarumma. And La Pista must have been sweating in that position. But then it's still an attack again for Magic Man right here. It is up a Meccano. Finds Rabio in the midfield. Rabio taking the ball back to Hernandez. Hernandez finds Aurelien Chomeni. Chomeni to Jules Kunde, who is playing on that left back row. Wow. Quite an ex, I mean, an impressive selection of players right here. Not a usual that a French national team will put up, but then that is what Magic Man feels comfortable with. Here comes Hakimi for Paris Saint Germain. Labista on that right flank. Hakimi, ball rolls that, finds Mbappe. Mbappe! Couldn't get through with a skill move. And Magic Man definitely knew that his opponent will be going in that direction. Stopping him right on that spot. It is Dembele here for the French national team. Magic Man trying to find Mbappe with a long through pass there. Couldn't get to him. 74 minutes of action, ladies and gentlemen. And there's nothing here to separate these two gentlemen as they are looking for that glorious opportunity to represent Ghana camp the orange esports experience in Abidjan this weekend. It is Lionel Messi here for the Paris Saint-Germain team. Finds Neymar Jr. Neymar Jr. Cuts back. Finds Messi again. It's Lionel Messi. And it looks like he doesn't know what to do with the ball. Luckily, he gets it to Verratti. Verratti to Thiago Mendes. Mendes finds Verratti. A quick one-two right there. There's Verratti again. Labista controlling affairs right here, probably taking charge of the possession in this game. But then no goal yet. And Messi, once again, a faulty move right there. But here comes Kingsley Coleman, the French national team, are on the ascendancy right here. 82 minutes of action. Can this be that first opportunity? Can this be that first goal right there? But then Kingsley Coleman ball rolls the ball into, I mean, out of the touchline. Quick throw in right there, affected by Labista. The game has been dragging, a very slow game indeed. And I'm sure if you are in the audience, no one probably will be liking this game. But then, of course, that is how it is sometimes with, you know, esports games, particularly with eFootball, particularly with FIFA right here. Sometimes, especially in a game of this nature, where there is that deciding factor, it usually starts cautiously, where both players would want to test out each other's strength before they come in with all their tactics. 88 minutes, the clock is ticking, and no goal yet right here. It is Magic Man finds Jules Kunde. Kunde again in possession. Kunde again to Rabio. Rabio finds Chomeni in the center. It is Mbappe. Quick pass to Dembele right there. Dembele finds Mbappe, and that was close. And Antoine Griezmann almost getting that first goal. But then, of course, another brave goalkeeping move there from Gianluigi de Roma, saving La Pista right there in that moment. The resulting corner kick played shortly by Kingsley Coman to Griezmann with another cross right there. But then the Paris Saint-Germain defense have been on their toes, keeping La Pista safe. And all too soon, that brings us to the end of the first game between 
La Pista and Magic Man right here as we are playing that best of five series to find who represents Ghana on that Orange Esports you know, stage. But then uh, it's a best of five series. So quickly we are moving on to that second game. Mind you, now we have done with one game. So four games. All right, so we get back into the game. It is La Pista here who kicks off for us with his same Paris Saint-Germain team. Neymar Jr. twisted and turning on that left flank. Neymar finds Lionel Messi. Neymar again. And those three personalities always looking to wreak some havoc in the attack. But then it didn't work out for, I mean, the three of them. Talking about Lionel Messi, Kylian Mbappe, and of course, Neymar Jr. Here comes Magic Man now in this opportunity right here. It's Kingsley Coleman finds Rabio. Rabio to Mbappe. Mbappe gets to Kingsley Coleman again. Lofted pass finds Mbappe. And Magic Man trying to, you know, stir up his magic from deep within. Not really getting the results. But then here comes Kingsley Coleman. Is he going to bend one from his left foot? But then he chooses to find Rabio with that pass right there. It's Kingsley Coleman drawing the ball back into the midfield. And it looks like that high person from Paris Saint-Germain is working for La Bista right here. He's keeping, I mean, Magic Man at bay. And it's really working to effect right here. But then here comes La Bista, Renato Sanchez, the Portuguese, finds Mbappe with that through pass right there on the right flank. Mbappe with a cutback. Lionel Messi to Sanchez. But then Vrani was there to put a foot in to stop that attack for Magic Man, I mean, for La Bista. La Bista here with that resulting corner kick. It's Lionel Messi running towards the center, finds Verratti. Verratti, and it looks like this was a practice one from the training grounds, but it didn't work for La Bista right here. Here comes Magic Man playing out there from defense to attack. It is a Pomecano, finds Thiago Mendes. Sorry, it finds Mbappe. Mbappe gets into the center to Chouameni. Chouameni. Still with the ball right here. It's an excellent position from Mbappe. What was he looking to do? He has that sweet left foot, which could have gotten him that goal right here. <laughs> Interesting times right here. It doesn't look like these two players are really looking for a goal. They get into exciting positions, but then they fail to get those shots right through. Here comes Hashraf Hakimi to Renato Sanchez. Ball gets to Ramos, quick one to Hakimi, to Marquinhos. Marquinhos back to Ramos, who is gallantly starring in that defensive midfield role for the Paris Saint-Germain team. It's Renato Sanchez, who has not been so effective on that right flank, I must admit. Probably La Bista might look into, you know, putting in some changes or some substitution right there. But then, of course, he knows best and he knows what he wants to achieve with this team right here. Here comes Sergio Ramos finds Mbappe. Mbappe gets it to Verratti. Verratti to Renato Sanchez. Back to Verratti again. Marco Verratti finds Marquinhos. It's Hakimi here. Back to Marquinhos. Wow. What a drag of a gameplay right here. Labista just prodding the ball around comfortably in his own space. But then Magic Man coming through with that interception right here. It is the best of five series, the side end fixture right here between La Bista and Magic Man. You know, others call him Konka. And I know his actual name is Nanajiman. But then, Magic Man is not Magic in today at all. Neither is La Bista, La Bistin. Uh, you know, probably sometime I would want to find out why La Bista goes by that name, La Bista. Definitely he can tell us more. But then here comes Magic Man with the French national team who are in that white kit right here. Antoine Griezmann finds that chance and here is the first goal, ladies and gentlemen. But then VAR has pulled that goal back, unfortunately. Mbappe was in that offside position and therefore the goal isn't going to stand. We still have a goalless decision right here. I mean a goalless situation. The second game of the day in that best of five series and there isn't any goal yet between both sides. Magic Man zero, La Pista zero. But then here comes La Pista again. Failing to move that attack running. Magic Man on the right flank. The skilling Mbappe for the French national team. Bent one cross in there. Couldn't find the target. 
It's Rabio with Kinsley Coman. Well, that is a classic goal, ladies and gentlemen. Eventually, we have gotten a goal which is going to stand. That elastico right there from Coman opened up the defense, and that left foot shot into the right bottom corner was just so sweet. Second game, and Magic Man is up by a goal as against La Besta. Interesting times right here. Is this going to spell out how the remaining matches is going to be? Is Magic Man going to be having that upper hand right here? We can only wait to see. Here comes La Besta trying to get that drag back in there. But then very, very gallant defending there from Magic Man who didn't fret. He stood his ground and cleared the ball out into some safe position right there. And that brings us to the end of the first half action first 45 minutes done right here between la Bista and magic man it is that road to the orange esport experience of course brought to you by the ghana esports federation in together in i mean in collaboration with arena 233 where we're having this live event right here the decider between la Bista and magic man second half of the second game underway right here mind you it is magic man who is in the lead with that lone goal right there from Kingsley Coman. Magic Man here with that French national team. Excellent stop right there from La Bista in midfield. Here comes Lionel Messi trying to get the ball into Mbappe, who isn't really getting his runs timed very, very effectively here today. It is Aurelien Chouameni for the French national team. Magic Man definitely is in some space of comfort right here after getting that first goal and i'm sure he'll be looking to add more and you know pile on the misery for la Bista. but then here comes rabio finds chomeni in the center la Bista stopping that attack right here but then he has also been stopped he refused to be stopped neymar jr on that left flank for the paris saint germain team it's a tit for tat affair right there in midfield and both players are really really hungry for the ball and for, and it looks like no player is actually able to hang on for more than five minutes very very crucial times right here here comes Neymar Jr again on that left flank Neymar finds Messi but then Varani went to that right foot stopping Messi there and like I've said these two players they know each other so well so they definitely know how they both operate in attack and so it is going to be those fine thin lines that are going to be separating those two here today and it is no wonder that after two games in fact we still are in that second game but then there's only one goal which has come in so far it's la Bista with renato sanchez in a dangerous position there but then magic man again doing his defensive duties so perfectly here comes la Bista. neymar jr finds Mbappe. can this be that equalizer oh. But then Mbappe couldn't get that ball steering into the net. Flashed right in front of the goal. And I'm sure you could hear La Bista scream in frustration and anguish. La Bista almost getting an equalizer right there. But then this is, I mean, Magic Man being very lucky right here. Another attack for La Bista. It's Lionel Messi. Cuts back to Neymar Jr. Jr. Twisting and turning with that pullback. And Neymar Jr., well, a rebound fell to him, but then Mike Nan was there to make that save. He has a resulting corner kick. It's Neymar, shot one to Lionel Andres Messi, the Argentine hero, that man who recently led the Argentina team to World Cup glory. It's Messi again, but then that cheeky pass couldn't find its way to Mbappe in the center excellent defending once again for magic man who now is in possession kinsley coman carrying that ball finds kilian mbappe lotin mbappe cuts back to jose kunde here come the french national team has been paraded by magic man right here 73 minutes on the clock about 27 minutes to the end of this second game right here it is Magic Man who is up by a goal here with that French national team. Goal scored by Kingsley Coman. And La Bista is really, really making all efforts trying to get in an equalizer. But then 
Of course, Magic Man is definitely managing this game very, very well. He is holding on to possession as we are in the dying minutes. Here comes La Besta with that lofted pass there. Presnel Kimpembe finds Marquinhos, another Brazilian international right there. Ball falls to Thiago Mendes, Portuguese. It's the Italian Marco Verratti right here to the Brazilian Neymar Jr. Dos Santos. Neymar Jr. finds Mbappe. And that is the equalizer that La Pista has been searching for. Kylian Mbappe on that twist. Short firing with that right foot right there. And that brings us to 1-1 one, one in the game right here. And both players are now going into their benches probably looking for some fresh legs to come in there. Uh, we'll definitely will be checking out that change is happening right here. But let me remind you, this is the road to the Orange eSport experience. And, I mean, this is brought to you by the Ghana eSports Federation in collaboration with Arena 233 eSports Center. And it looks like there is, this decider is going to be one that will go down to the very, very last drop. Uh, two, I mean, five, best of five series here. But then we have two games, actually, which have been played now. We are still in that second game. And already it is 1-1, one, one, the scoreline. 81 minutes of action. Paris Saint Germain won. The French national team won. La Bista won, of course. Magic Man won. Here comes Magic Man again. Up Meccano. Couldn't get the ball anywhere. It's La Bista who will regain that possession. Neymar Jr. finds Lionel Andres Messi. Messi slowly, slowly pushing the ball forward. Messi. Couldn't get that ball through to Mbappe Lutin. And here comes Osman Dembele for Magic Man. Trying to start a quick attack right there. But then the goalkeeper, Kian Lugi Donnarumma, coming to fetch that ball for La Bista. Hakimi, the Moroccan international, on the right flank there for La Bista. Finds Lionel Andres Messi. Messi finds Sarabia, who is a fresh leg right here. Pablo Sarabia. Another Argentine right there. Here comes Line Andres Messi, twisting and turning, putting together all those kill moves, trying to create some space right there. Here comes Messi to Mbappe. But another excellent defender there from Verani, saving Magic Man right there. And that brings us, ladies and gentlemen, to the end of that game. The second game also being a stalemate right here. 1 1 the scoreline was, and wow. What can really separate these two gentlemen? We definitely can't wait to see that. But then we are going now into that third game. Mind you, it is a best of five series. And if probably we had, I mean, one player winning all two fixtures, probably this third fixture would have been that do or die situation. But then there is no winner yet after two games. So let's straightly get into that third game, which is on your screens right now. Again, both players going back for that same team setup. It is Paris Saint-Germain again versus the French national team. Magic Man playing with France. And of course, Labista playing with the Paris Saint-Germain team who are in that blue-black kit, the traditional home kit for the Paris Saint-Germain team. And of course, the French national team who are their wayside here playing with a white strip and blue pants too much. In that second game, we saw Magic Man taking the lead only to be equalized by La Bista. So let's see how this third game goes like. Hashraf Hakimi with a long searching pass looking for Mbappe, but then excellent defending there from the French national team. And Magic Man will look to build an attack of his own right here. He has Osman Dembele. Dembele on that right flank finds Verratti in the middle to Rabio, Rabio to Verratti again. Verratti finds Mbappe. And that was a chance there for Magic Man, but then Mbappe was just too slow on the ball for him. And the goalkeeper was quick to come get it. Marquinhos, the captain, finds Lionel Messi, who has dropped very deep into defence. I wonder what he is doing there. But then here comes Neymar Jr. on the attack on the left flank. Neymar Jr. beat one defender, but then couldn't beat the second one. And of course, Magic Man will take over possession at this moment. Here comes Kylian Mbappe, finds Osman Dembele on the right flank. Dembele... He is that player who has that versatile feet. He has both left and right foot working with that same strength. But couldn't make anything out of the ball. La Bista also couldn't make anything out of that attack. And so here comes Magic Man again. Here is Varani. 
Varani to upper Meccano, Meccano back to Varani. Varani finds Jules Kunde with a long searching pass on that left flank. Jules Kunde finds Andre Rabio. Rabio again, right here. Jules Kunde back to Rabio. Another very slow start to the game right here between Magic Man and La Bista. 24 minutes of action in that first half. Let me remind you that we are live from the very plush, I mean, eSports center of Arena 233, where we are bringing to you this deciding fixture right here. La Bista getting that shot on target, but then goalkeeper Mike Nan saving that ball as it came straight towards him. Here comes Hernandez. Oh, beautiful one there from Messi with a roulette. It's a tit for tat at fair right there. Renato Sanchez almost getting some space to get a ball through. Here's Neymar Jr. Finds Lionel Andres Messi here. Messi to Sergio Ramos. Back to Messi. Messi looking for a partner to play that one-two pass with. He finds Mbappe. But Mbappe gets it to Neymar Jr. Here is Mbappe again. Mbappe gets it back to Verratti. Verratti to Messi. Messi to Sergio Ramos. Ramos. And ladies and gentlemen, I mean, this game has been one where both sides are really earnestly looking for spaces in the defense, but there is no space at all. Not a single iota of space. When you just twist to your left, thinking, you know, there will be space on your right, you get there and Magic Man is there. When Magic Man is also without opportunity, he moves to the left and La Bista definitely has a foot there to clear those balls. Here comes Magic Man. The French national team are on an attack right here. Kingsley Koma finds personal Kimpembe. Kimpembe trying to get the ball through, but then fortunately he's been stopped. Here will, here's Varati finding Thiago Mendes, the Portuguese, on that left flank for the Paris Saint Germain team. Here comes La Bista with another very faulty pass. Very, very faulty pass. Wow. What an evening we are having right here. We're looking for. The Ghanaian champion who will be representing Ghana, Ghana, Ghana on that African stage right there. The Orange eSports experience, mind you, is an African eSports experience and you can't find the excitement that happens there anywhere else in this world. And that is why we are earnestly looking for the best of our Ghanaian gamers to represent Ghana on that stage as supported by the Ghana eSports Federation. Still a stalemate right here. The clock is ticking, and in no time, the referee will be blowing his whistle to end the first half proceedings. But here comes La Bista looking for that last minute chance right here. But then, of course, we have come to the end of the first half. It is a best of five series, ladies and gentlemen, happening live at the Arena 233. We're looking for our winner. And who is that going to be? Uh, La Bista versus Magic Man. Now, let me tell you one thing about these two players. These two players, uh, they have known themselves for a very long time. They have partnered and played throughout several tournaments, including, you know, that GGC Rep Country World Cup tournament, which happened in recent times. And they actually went through straight to the final and actually took the trophy home. So these two players, they know each other so, so well. So coming up against each other definitely will be dicey and tricky. But then here we go into the second half of that third game still goalless right here here comes Antoine Griezmann for Magic Man Griezmann finds Kimpembe wondering why Kimpembe will be in attack for Magic Man but then here comes Labista he's been stopped again it's Rabio now who couldn't get that through pass through, so he twisted in 10, gets into, into the center. Aurelien Chouameni, Chouameni, slowly looking for a target right here. Aurelien Chouameni, that youngster, who now plies his trade for the Real Madrid team here. Aurelien Chouameni gets it to Andre Rabio. Rabio also turning and twisting. Magic Man looking for that loophole in defense, but look at that setup. Looks like a four-man defensive setup with two defensive midfielders in the frame of Marco Verratti and 
Sergio Ramos. They are just doing that shielding for the goalpost of La Bista. Here comes Verratti attacking. Line on Messi. Beautiful skill move there. Line on just Messi trying to get that through pass through to Neymar, who was in an offside position, so ball couldn't get to him. Fernandez finds Jules Kunde, Kunde for the French national team. And Magic Man once again losing that ball in that position there. 60 minutes, an hour played in this third game, and we still have no one winning yet. Very, very interesting times right here. These two players seem to match each other's strength perfectly without a hitch. Here comes La Bista. Kylian Mbappe feeding in a right footed shot, but then hitting that human wall of a defense. And that counter attack looks like a sweet one right here, but then also stopped right in the tracks by Mendes for the Paris Saint Germain team. Here comes Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos finding Messi. Messi finds. Renato Sanchez. Sanchez coming in with an interception there. Again, here is Labista. Marco Verratti finds Renato Sanchez. Sanchez to Mbappe. Mbappe cuts back. It's Mbappe again. And those, you know, quick, witty passes not working. And for a matter of fact, the referee had his lines. Man, checking that offside signal. And so the offside was given. Quickly taken. It is La Bista again trying to build another attack right here. Paris Saint Germain for La Bista. Line on rest Messi. Messi Curicini on that left flank. Here comes Verratti. Verratti to Renato Sanchez. Sanchez, oh, beautiful right there. But then. No result yielding from those skill moves. Now, I have said this time and over and over again that if you're making skill moves, they definitely should have a purpose of opening up the defense or opening up a passing spot for you and your, you know, your target. But then when you are playing against an opponent and you just you know, make fun with the skill moves rather than creating those chances, it comes against your own loss. It comes at your own loss. Because if you get the goals early enough, you can relax and probably enjoy the game later and show as many skill moves as you want. But then, you know, just sometimes these players will want to you know, showboat a little. Here comes the French national team. Mbappe finds Griezmann. Griezmann couldn't stand on the ball. Very strong defense right there. Back underway in the game right here. Here comes La Bista. And to be frank with you, these two players have really played out a boring game for me right here. I'm looking for that excitement, but then they just, I know, playing out as if there is nothing at stake. But mind you, there is that qualification berth, there is that qualification slot at stake to represent Ghana on that stage. And there is a 2,500 euro prize spot for that FIFA championship in the Orange eSports experience. La Bista here with Verratti. Verratti finds Mbappe. Quick one, two there. It's Marco Verratti. Finds Mbappe again. Mbappe trying to look for Renato Sanchez on the flanks. Couldn't get to him. Here comes Magic Man on the attack on the left flank. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Dembele looking for targets for the pass right there. Gets it back into the center. It's Dembele again for Magic Man. Magic Man with Dembele. Couldn't get the ball to you. And I'm wondering, is this an issue of the controllers or is it an issue of the players themselves? But then on that note, we wrap up that third game right here. We're done with the 90 minutes and we still have no separating factor right here. Wow, a best of five series and after three games, there isn't a winner in each of the matches. They have all ended in draws. Actually, we have two goalless draws and one draw, which ended in, you know, a 1-1 one -one scoreline. But then we're going straight away into the fourth game of the day. Maybe, maybe, maybe in this game, we are going to be seeing some goals. I'm sure some of you definitely, I mean, supporting from home, whether for La Bista or for Magic Man, should be saying some alpha hour prayers right here for both of them. They definitely needed to get in those goals right there. But then let's get into that fourth game of the day. Four minutes of action in the first half. It's Magic Man again with his French national team. And of course, La Bista playing with that Paris Saint-Germain team. 
the French are in the white kit with the blue pants or blue shorts. And of course, La Bista with his Paris Saint Germain squad in the dark, I mean, the, maybe the dark blue or the blue black strip, some will call it. Here comes Messi, but the ball has been stolen away from him. The resulting corner kick ready to take place. It's Neymar Jr. right behind the ball. And look at that. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Well, goal kick here. Magic Man quickly taking that one. It is the French national team who are in possession here. Ball finds Hernandez on that left flank. Theo Hernandez gets it to Apomecano. Apomecano finds Chouameni in the midfield. It is Aurelien Chouameni with another very faulty pass right there from Magic Man. And I'm sure his pass accuracy today probably would be very low. I wouldn't want to grade it in percentage, but then it is very low. Here comes Lionel Messi stopping the ball from going off the touchline. But then another faulty pass right there. What is happening to both players? Earlier on, they probably showed a strong intent of attack, but then it looks like that all has died down and this game has been dragging, really, really dragging. It's Man Dembele for Magic Man on that right flank. Brings the ball to a halt, cuts back, finds Jules Kunde to Chouameni. Chouameni right here in the midfield, twisting and turning. Magic Man to Jules Kunde. Kunde. Here comes Andre Rabiot in midfield for the French national team. It's Dembele. Finds Mbappe who couldn't get through with a skill move. And Lionel Messi strong on the ball. Wow, La Bista with an attack right here. It's Lionel Messi Kudicini. The ball got to Hakimi who couldn't stay strong on the ball. And so a quick dispossession there gets the ball to Magic Man who was uh, failing to produce those stellar attacking football that we know him for. And to be frank with you, these two players are not really serving me with the best of gameplays that day. I have witnessed from them in previous times. Here comes a quick opportunity. Lionel Messi trying to get in a quick goal right there from that quick cross. But then another attack again for La Vista. Sergio Ramos. Finds Kimpembe, Kimpembe to Lionel Messi. Messi gets it to Mbappe. Mbappe finds it to Renato Sanchez on that right flank. Renato Sanchez gets it to Messi, but he's been pushed off the ball right there, bullied by that French national team defense right there. And Magic Man has an opportunity again to build an attack. Slowly, he does it. Theo Hernandez to Verani. Verani, long searching pass, finds Kunde on the right side of attack or right side of defense, I would say. Here comes Theo Hernandez. Hernandez moving forward the ball slowly, slowly, slowly. Finds Andre Rabiot. Rabiot to Dembele. And referee spots an infringement right there. Ball is in a very dangerous position. It's a free kick in favor of Magic Man. And can Magic Man bend this one in there? It's Antoine Griezmann behind the ball. Mbappe was also behind that one. Let's see who is actually going to get a nod to take this one. It's Griezmann with a knuckle short. Almost getting into that right bottom corner. But then, Gianluigi Dunaroma, who is as tall as, you know, one of the tallest goalkeepers, with a very big size there, filling the frame, diving to his left and saving the ball there. Excellent saves that we've actually seen from this goalkeeper right here in this fixture. La Bista with Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos finds Hashraf Hakimi. Hakimi finds Sanchez. Sanchez gets the ball to Mbappe and La Bista building a sweet attack right here. Here comes Theo Hernandez. La Bista with a sweet attack. But then the human wall 
getting the ball into safe place for the defense of Magic Man and that brings us again to the end of the first half of the fourth match and we still have no goal yet wow still no goals yet so we're going into that second half of the game uh, but then before that the players would want to you know reshuffle their teams reshuffle their tactics probably bring him in put some fresh ideas into masterminding the win right there and mind you this is the qualification stage to you represent ghana at the orange esports experience already uh, we have a player who will be representing ghana for e-football also there was one representing ghana for tekken so uh, i'm hoping these players go out there to do ghana proud but then today we need to get one player who will be representing Ghana in the FIFA 23 championship right here. 48 minutes of action in that fourth game of the day. It is Rabio finding no one in particular. Neymar Junior got to the ball, but he's also been dispossessed. And here comes an opportunity. It is Mbappe who is speeding ahead of the defenders. Mbappe! Magic man took his time with that one. Mbappe with a foot from the outside foot. I mean, with a shot from the outside foot of his right leg, getting in that goal. And can La Vista get that response? He almost did, but then the referee was quick to spot that offside. And Magic man has sprung again into the lead. Can he maintain the lead this time? Or oh, are we going to see La Vista? Pulling up an equalizer again. 55 minutes of action. Jose Kunde. Kunde finds Antoine Griezmann. Griezmann to Mbappe. And this time it looks like Magic Man really, really wants to get more goals. It's Orlen Chormeni. Ball gets to La Bista as he wins that one in the heart of defense. He definitely is that man hungry for an equalizer here can he get it slowly building the attack variety variety finds neymar jr neymar to mendes mendes has been pushed off the ball defensive bullying there from of course the french national team and here comes usman dembele for the french dembele on the right flank trying to ball roll the ball couldn't do that to perfection la Bista again in attack can he get that equalizer he is frantically searching for that goal that will bring him at par before of course Nanajima runs off and here comes la Bista with that equalizer that he has been searching for coming straight from the left boot of one of the greatest of all times lionel andres messi showing us that he is definitely a master of this game and of course la Bista had to add that celebration it is his favorite it is that celebration where he sits like an indian crosses his legs and then holds onto an imaginary game pad telling you that i am the best gamer right here but then is he actually going to be the best gamer one one the scoreline is 70 minutes of action here comes Magic Man again with another attack, and he has been stopped. La Vista. And here comes La Vista again, trying to find spaces and slots, and those things are difficult to find in this particular game. Like I have announced earlier, these two players are both teammates from the same team. And La Pista, he has completed that comeback. After going down by a goal, he got that equalizer. And again, that same gentleman, Kylian Mbappe, got in him the second goal in the 74th minute of action right here. Wow, what a game, what a game, what a game, what a game. Looks like the French national team are gradually disappearing out of sight. Here comes Magic Man, who definitely is also looking for an equalizer right here. It is Magic Man twisting and turning, but one turn too many caught him looking for the ball all around. And of course, Michael was there to pick him. 
Here is Labista with another attack. Mbappe, beautiful dribble right there. It's Mbappe advancing the ball, probably himself. But then here is Thiago Mendes who comes to his aid and Verratti quickly gets hold of that one as well. Thiago Mendes. Mendes find no one in particular. So the French will come to their aid. That was quite an excellent race there between Osman Dembele and Mendes. Both players really have some excellent pace. And it looks like Thiago Mendes, I mean, uh, Mendes in that defensive capacity got the ball. Here comes La Bista. La Bista on another attack. Is he going to get that third goal here? It is La Bista moving the ball around. It's Mbappe for La Bista right here. Mbappe shakes off the first marker, gets the ball into some good position. It is Mbappe again. And he has just moved the ball out of the touchline. And that brings us to the end of the fourth game, ladies and gentlemen. And after that game, we eventually have a winner, La Bista, coming tops of that particular match uh, with a 2-1 scoreline right there. He came down from one goal and got into, you know, the leading position, getting as our first winner. So now we have just one match to go. It is that last deciding match. And this match is going to show us who is representing Ghana on that African stage, on that, you know, uh, classic stage right there of the orange esports experience but then like i've said today we aren't wasting any time at all we are going straight into that fifth game of the day the last game i might say and so it is actually that final final game right there the very grand final this is a determinant is magic man going to win this and come at par with la Bista, or is la Bista actually going to continue with his win and already la Bista has got a goal right here Lionel Mercy, the man in the jersey with number 30, getting an early goal in that sixth minute right here. And it looks like La Bista is piling misery for Magic Man right here. Here comes Magic Man, who got that shock of a goal in the first six minutes, looking to equalize very early on. And looks like he wants business, he wants business. Here is La Bista. La Bista to Kylian Mbappe to Renato Sanchez. Sanchez with the ball fails to move it any further up the pitch. And they have been stopped by the French national team. Here comes Nanajiman, popularly known as Magic Man, also known as Konka. And I'm wondering if there are any other names, but then these are all that I know for now. It looks like today his magic has fallen into some deep ocean. Things aren't working for Magic Man at all. La Pista has quenched, you know, all his magic tricks. Probably he stole his magic book before coming right here. Who knows? Here is Magic Man with another attack. It is Magic Man with that drag back right there. But then, so unnecessary. Trust me. Here comes La Pista. Ah, that through pass couldn't get onto the right path for Mbappe to run onto. And so that another attack here for La Bista's Paris Saint-Germain team Os I mean Kylian Mbappe has been stopped right there we are in the final game ladies and gentlemen this is the match that is going to be determining who is representing Ghana on that orange esport experience and this deciding fixture was brought to you by the Ghana Esports Federation, of course, in partnership with the Arena 233 Esports Center. Here comes Kylian Mbappe for the Paris Saint Germain team. He fetched the ball to Thiago Mendes, who couldn't hold on to it. And so the French national team will regain possession. It is Magic Man. Ah, another field move right there. La Bista also couldn't get to it. And it's a tussle right there in the midfield of the pitch. Magic Man. Jules Kunde gets the ball to Rafael Varani. Rafael Varani to Orlin Chouameni. Chouameni finds it to Mbappe. Sorry. To, yes, Mbappe. 
not being able to get the ball through. It is still Magic Man knocking on the doors of La Bista for that equalizer. Magic Man with an elastic goal and he gets the goal right there. Antoine Griezmann, who else could have done it? And the game is on. 1-1 one, one the scoreline is now after 32 minutes of action played. Here comes Renato Sanchez. Sanchez gets it to Hakimi. Hakimi, quick one-two, gets the ball back. Sanchez. He has been very ineffective on that right flank, I must say. I thought things were going to get better for him, but then it isn't going as planned at all, at all, at all right here. A corner kick here for La Bista. And Neymar Jr. right behind that ball. A quick exchange with Lionel Messi. And Lionel Messi twisting 360 degrees on the pitch. Finds Renato Sanchez back to Messi again. Messi finds Sanchez who has that strength but then couldn't make any use of that strength at all. Ball still moving dangerously for Magic Man here. There's La Bista who is trying to find those goals with those witty, witty passes. And is that going to be a penalty kick? It is a penalty. Referee has pointed to the spot and it is Mbappe behind the ball who will be taking this for La Bista. Magic Man definitely at the edge of his seat. Is this going through? It goes through. And we have the second goal for La Bista right here. 2-1 the scoreline is. And La Bista coming on top again against Magic Man. 2-1 the scoreline is, ladies and gentlemen. And it looks like both players will want to visit their bench to get in. So, you know, some fresh legs, some changes. And I can see some tactical tweaks as well from um, the French national team. Magic Man is looking to bolster his team, trying to twist, you know, the, the tweaks, you know, the tricks, trying to see if he can actually get an opportunity to get some equalizers and also get a goal. But then, of course, we are definitely enjoying this game. No matter how slow down it has been, we are really enjoying this game right here between uh, Magic Man and La Bista. It is that deciding fixture. It has been a best of five series, but now we are in that final game. Who is representing Ghana on the Orange eSport experience? Uh, we can only wait to see. But then at the moment, La Bista is leading the scoreline. Look at that playback, the penalty spot. Mbappe slotting comfortably with his right foot into the left bottom corner of the goalpost taking goalkeeper Mainan to the other side. Now we're underway again. Magic Man now with possession. Here comes Griezmann, the Magic Man. Griezmann, beautiful move there, but then also another brave, 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 brave opportunity. All right, that brings us to the very first half. I mean, the end of the first half of the game of that final match between La Bista and Magic Man, the decider to determine who was representing Ghana on that orange eSports platform right there, happening in Abidjan, Ivory Coast this weekend, the 28th and 29th of January, to be very spe I mean, specific. It is La Bista on another attack with this Paris Saint-Germain team, losing the ball to Magic Man there. Magic Man, Jules Koundé. Kunde finds Dembele, but you know Dembele couldn't actually get to it. So Thiago Mendes, you know that boy has some brilliant space right there. Oh, look at that! Excellent skill move from Neymar Jr. He is a five-star skiller, so it is no surprise that he is pulling all those skill moves now. And La Bista seems to be comfortable at this stage, you know, bringing to bear all his skills and all of that. But then here comes Neymar Jr. Gets it to Lionel Messi. Messi on the edge of the box, drags it back to Thiago Mendes. Mendes finds. Marquinhos, who went straight to Mbappe, but Mbappe couldn't, you know, stay with that possession. Here comes Magic Man, who probably will be looking for an equalizer. The clock is ticking against him. It is now or never. Is La Pista going to be the one representing Ghana? Or is Magic Man at this stage going to bring on a surprise? Because mind you, La Pista has won one game already in this best of five series. And if he looks to add 
another one definitely he is going to be the man mind you before the game these both i mean both of these players promise us nothing but wins and it looks like it is one person you know staying true to his word right here here comes la Bista. an opportunity to get a third goal a drag back right there from mbappe but then that was one scale too many the space opened up but then he decided to you know do that reverse elastico again and that couldn't get the ball anywhere here comes magic man it is now or never 62 minutes played magic man he's been brought down but then the referee has waved that off he has deemed it as a legal tackle there and so la Bista will be looking to build an, an attack again neymar junior who has also been stopped on the other side by of course rafael varani ladies and gentlemen we have played 65 minutes here La Bista leading by two goals to one where there's Paris Saint-Germain team and Magic, Magic Man who is tagging along closely behind has, you know, one goal as opposed to two from La Bista. It is La Bista again with the ball. He loses it, but then still La Bista in possession. Ball finds Thiago Mendes looking to bend the cross in, but then the confidence wasn't enough. Here comes Le Bleu of the French national team trying to build an attack right here. But then Le Bleu couldn't get it through. A rebound right there. Magic Man almost getting lucky as the ball fell to his feet twice. But then couldn't steer it into the net. Wow. What a lucky moment there for La Bista. But then La Bista has gifted the ball right here. And can he be punished for that? Well, it looks like Konka or Magic Man is being very generous today. He should have been punishing Mag I mean, La Bista for that mistake there. And here comes La Bista again with another attack. Losing that out. Paris Saint-Germain. Now on the defensive end. Magic Man, the clock is ticking. Mbappe with a stop right there. It is Mbappe, Magic Man, trying to get an equalizer, but then, ah, very unfortunate for him. But then the referee has spotted something. It is actually an infringement. And that was played in favor of La Bista right here. But then here comes Magic Man again. It is last minute chance for him. La Bista coming right there forward with his goalkeeper, but another opportunity. And it looks like Magic Man has lost any touch of magic or luck today. Some very close chances coming his way, but then he has managed to flush them all. And here comes La Pista with that final opportunity. It is Mbappe speeding on ahead. And that is the goal that will bring comfort for La Pista. And he is pulling clear. Three goals to one. And here comes Sergio Ramos. That goal scorer staring the port right there. He is actually staring some very sweet, you know, probably soup that uh, probably La Pista will be drinking after this particular match. And ladies and gentlemen, three goals to one is the scoreline now. Mbappe getting that very important third goal for La Pista. And it looks like if the match is going to be ending this way, then La Pista is going to be that gentleman representing ghana on that stage the clock is ticking it is now or never for magic man who seemingly looks frustrated right here it looks like he is probably admitting and conceding defeat but then he wouldn't do so without putting up a fight we are now in that last minute of our time here comes la Bista with that last opportunity it is neymar jr moving on in that attack right there neymar can he add to it neymar would have loved to pass but renato sanchez couldn't get to it and that brings us to the end ladies and gentlemen the decider has been decided we have a champion for the day and it is no one but la pista who is the winner of the five match series 
who is actually going to represent Ghana right there on the Ivory Coast match. But then let's go for a quick break and we'll be back to speak to the players to get how they fell throughout this match. Mind you, this was brought to you by the Ghana Esports Federation in collaboration with the Arena 233 Esports. It is the road to the Orange Esports experience. We'll be back after this break. Kojo Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it, why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say they base it. Yeah. Kojo Charlie, where the boys day? Screws, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it, why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it, why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say sh they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like catch it. Why no catch it, catch it? Who do you think 
think you are? Your phone only smart, goo goo doo me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it, most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Yeah, Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Screws, two screws lose, they like catchy, why no catch a catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone only smart, goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it, most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Yeah, Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Q Bruce screws, two screws lose, they like catchy, why no catch a catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone only smart, goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Q Bruce screws, two screws lose. They like catchy, why no catch a catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone only smart, goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys there? Q Bruce screws, two screws lose. They like catchy, why no catch a catchy? Who do you think you are? Your phone only smart, goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it, most of these new rappers, they know this stage, they base it. Yeah. Alright, welcome Kojo, back Charlie, here where to the boys there? 33 Esports Center, where we have just witnessed that, you know, deciding series of matches to actually get a winner to represent Ghana right there on the international stage, of course, on that orange eSport experience. Now, this deciding match came between this gentleman right here on my left hand and his co, I mean, his partner in crime. But then today, they decided to come up against each other. Uh, it brings to mind, you know, some, you know, Mexican cartels when they turn up against each other after, you know, yeah, they need to share some money and all that. But then uh, this was a stage where one of them needed to go for glory and they decided to face it out right here. Uh, Magic Man, how are you feeling after this particular match? Well, I'm feeling good. I'm still feeling good. And I want to say good old to Labista. He brought a very strong game. And I think he managed to steal my heart before the game. My magic heart, I don't know. I think he replaced it, so that's so, how so, the So, so then how are you able to feel good after losing your magic heart and losing this uh, particular uh, at, at the same time, he's still my uh, buddy, and we won um, a tournament together, so I still die for him and in the tournament. But then tell me about that match. That match started out very slowly. It looked like both of you were very cautious yeah, in your approach. Was, no, you, were, you, yeah. you weren't opening up, he wasn't opening up, and... It was very slow. It, was it something intentional or was just how difficult the match was? It was like, um, it was like we we're all steady and we don't, you didn't want to give the ball up. So everybody was just playing his best not to lose the ball. Yeah. But then eventually uh, it, was, it, was, it, was, it wasn't a bad loss. I mean, it was a very closely yeah. contested game, right? So, I mean, the last two matches where you actually lost it. But then what happened in that particular third well, game? I think you I, were in the lead and then you gave it up. Yeah, I, I don't even know what happened. It was just in the blink of an eye and it just happened. So I think I have to rectify that. And, and I think you also got a penalty then. I don't know what happened in that penalty, so I don't know. I think I have to write a report to FIFA or something. Well, unfortunately, it looks like our magic man lost his magic and he can't even explain what happened right there. But then, of course, I mean, uh, it happens in, e e I yeah, mean, in, yeah, in, in yeah, football, yeah. in gaming, in e-football, in e-soccer and all that. But then, of course, going forward, I mean, you're, you're, you're still partners, right? Yeah. No yeah. bad blood. So Never. you're supporting him right through? Never, no. All right. So definitely that is Magic Man, I mean, coming away with his words right there. He is pledging support for his partner in crime right there. But then, are you going to share the money in case he goes out there and wins, you know, that 1,250 euros, uh, the pot price for, I mean, the winner's price for the Orange East Post tournament? We don't want to you for concert. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, definitely some settlement needs to come through right there. And so um, that is it. Uh, we definitely are going to be speaking to our winner as well. And so um, that has been it. Thank you, Magic Man, for coming to you. All right. So coming up next is Obnwell Jeff. Uh, they call him La Bista. And today he will explain why he calls himself La Bista. But then welcome our champion. Champion, how are you feeling? Oh, yeah, I'm feeling good. I love your relaxedness. I love the composure. I love the smile. Uh, but then, 
on that seat when you're playing did he well, how are you feeling tell me talk to me yeah it was the same composure i took in the game that made me win that's why we started steadily i see well, congratulations to you um, this Thank is only you. the first stage. You are going out there to face some of the very best from Africa. I'm sure you definitely need to put a lot in your preparation. But then tell me, how are you going to do that? Yeah. So as I told you already, I have the tactics. Every day, every time, any day, I'm the man with the tactics. So I'm going in the game with my tactics. Your tactics really work, though. Because, I mean, you're an unsettled magic man totally. And till date, you can't explain what happened. He doesn't know what happened in there. But then, of course, um, um, tell me, how did you mastermind that, ma I mean, the, the, that third match? Sorry, the fourth match. How did you mastermind that victory? Because you were down, and then all of a sudden, we saw you coming up and then coming back completely. How did you do it? Yeah, fortunately, we have the chance to set five different formations in a game. So you have the formation you play when you are down, when you are at draw, when you are leading and all you have your tactics. So as I was down, I know what to bring in. Yeah. And as I do, as at that time, I could determine how he was feeling. So I knew wow. the tactics and how to play at them. Wow. Now, this really sounds like a very emotionally intelligent player right here who can actually feel what his opponent is going through and put in the tactics to unsettle him. But then, of course, congratulations to you right there. Um, but then, uh, what should Ghanaians be expecting from you as you go out there to represent Ghana? Yeah, they should expect the best and not the worst. Wow. Uh, I think I can actually rely on your word because, you know, before this game, you actually told us that you were going in for a win and nothing else and you stuck to your word. So we are going to be looking forward to you to expect nothing but the best. And so kudos to you. I uh, wish you all the best in all those endeavors right there. Thank you very much. All right. So um, all too soon, that brings us to the end of that deciding game right there, the deciding fixtures between uh, La Bista and Magic Man. You know, both players are from the Geon Legends team, and they had to face it out fiercely in that best of five series to get as a winner. And so, congratulations to La Bista, who, be, I'm sorry, uh, yeah, of course, La Bista, who's going out there to represent Ghana in Abidjan, Cote d'Ivoire, uh, on the ticket, of course, of the Ghana Esports Federation, uh, who have actually made this possible uh, in cooperation, of course, in collaboration with the Arena 233 Esports Center. My name is Vespa Kofi Sapon, and I'm honored to have brought this to you. Until we meet again in the community, stay safe out there. It is the Esports community right here. Have a great evening. See you. Very, very, very solid right there. Well, the ball was really tricky in the box, then they got themselves to get it. And can they finish it on GR Legends? It's going to be heartbreaking for play promise if this comes to pass. GR Legends! We have a rolling We have a rolling We have a We can a champion. We are on our way to crown a champion in a flash. Flashing of how you call it. What a way to crown yourself a champion. I am, bro. I am. I'm, 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 I'm too emotional at the moment. I just want to break down in tears. But, wow. Wow. Oh, God. I just don't know how to describe this feeling right now. What a day. And GL Legends can confirm that they are champions of the World Cup Series here at the Madagascar Esports Arena. Let's cast our mind back to the very first group match you played. How was that feeling for you? I think this, um, this, this experience is one of the best experiences in my life. I mean, we played before, yeah. yeah. Actually, at first, I didn't like the 2v2, but this, this was the time I got, like, I got so involved into the 2v2. I think I don't understand how the game works, so it's, it's one of the best experiences so far. But then let's get to the winning team, the champions. Can I have some start of uh, excitement? These boys, these boys will bring trouble to us. These boys will bring trouble. But then, gents, let's, let's just get into the conversations. How has this experience of the GGC Each Soccer World Cup been for you? Well, at the beginning of the tournament, I told everybody we have a special tool, a special weapon in our arsenal. Nobody believed us. And the play province boys, they talk a lot. That's all they know how to do. But we, we, we are action men. We come and we win. We don't joke around. You understand? 
So good win. Well, coach, what's on your tablet? What do you have in here? I have all my taxes on this tablet and all my secrets. No, well, what are those taxes? Explain to us what are the details of those taxes. It's my secret. I don't have to only. But then right now you've won. I'm sure you can share with your fellow teams. The last tournament you are playing, so I don't have to only it. You have to understand me. But which opponent was the very toughest opponent for you in this particular the tournament? Match, uh, the match against Wona Kid and Guy Kobe. Yeah, that was the toughest match. The A team? Yeah. You could see um, during this game, I was very calm. Yeah, I knew what my boys can do. Oh, so you knew it was a, a finished deal? It was already done? Yeah, but then you went down. You went down first. I mean, they took the lead. Yeah. Weren't you scared? Weren't you intimidated okay, by that goal? Let me cast your mind back to our game between uh, we and Sule. I made the same changes. We were down by two goals to now. Yeah, and it came and equalized. So you can see everything. And now the moment we have been waiting for that crowning moment, that beautiful trophy, the very maiden GTC E Soccer World Cup trophy, that very beautiful trophy. And right about now, it is going to be handed over to our champions, the GL legends. And applause, gentlemen, and applause, please. So, one, two, three. And the trophy has been lifted high. The trophy is flying aloft in the air. And they are kissing it. It's a beautiful trophy in them. All right, so this brings us to the very end of that GGC e Soccer World Cup Series. That was Dub Dub Rep Country 2022. We started with 12 teams, 12 countries, and we have our winner and our beloved Ghana Black Stars. They carry the day and Dion Legends, they actually did proud with that particular team. And so this is where we wrap up. And so I want to say a big thank you to our sponsors, to Waterfront All Services, to Prime Group of Companies, to Fixed Track GH, to Afri Socks, to Madagascar Esports Arena, to the Ghana Esports Federation, to our media partners MX24, and of course Esports African Esports, I mean, holding us down and taking coverage of this particular event. Also, thank you to you out there at home who joined the stream right from morning till dusk. In fact, to everyone who has supported in any way, to the entire crew of GGC, to the organizers, to everybody involved, uh, to my very honorable co-caster, Slimo Alexander Boateng, and of course, to myself, Vespa Kofi Sapon. This is why we sign out for the GGC E-Soccer World Cup Series. Please stay tuned, stay tuned to our GGC channel on YouTube, on Instagram, on Twitter, for details of, I mean, things that will be coming up. And so, this is where we wrap up. Uh, it has been a lovely production here. Thank you. Have a great day. See you with another GGC production soon. Bye. Yeah. Kojo, Charlie, where the boys day? Q Bruce Cruz, two screws lose. They like crack shit. Why no cap say catch it? Who do you think you are? Your phone will be smart. Goo goo dude, me at it. Your ex and your boo boo too. Charlie, let's face it. Most of these new rappers, they know they say shit. They base it.